Hello everyone, welcome back. Up front off road here, and today I'll be doing a review on the BF Goodrich KM3 Mud Terrain that I'm currently running on my 1998 Jeep TJ. And I've had these tires probably like a year, year and a about a year and a half now actually, and they have probably 11, 12,000 ish kilometers on them. As you can, I do rotate them, I've rotated them twice every 5,000 kilometers. And uh, you know, they're starting to get a little bit wore down, so we but uh, I don't I think you would call that rock rash. Little wee chips and cuts here and there. Some, I do do off-roading with it. But they're holding up quite well. The little rubber wear thingies are gone now. The rubber nipple things are finally gone. In the back, I just rotated these not that long ago. So I do, but, well, I'd say they're about the same as the front wear-wise. But they were a little better. But they're holding up really well. People say, oh, they chop really bad. And... That's only if you don't rotate them. If you rotate them, they don't they don't chop at all. I've run these before as well. And as long as you rotate them, they don't chop. And anyway, mud traction, they have been an exceptional tire. They're fairly soft, but not too soft where they're gonna wear out super fast. They're really good on the snow too. They're not the best thing on the ice. They're okay and they're better than, you know, big hard mud tires because they're not that hard. You know, they are fairly narrow. They're a 33105, so they do cut through the snow and slush a little better than some of those big wide tires but overall they're not the best choice on light snow and ice in deep snow though or deep mud exceptional exceptional tire they work really really well and i would recommend getting them you know they're not really that noisy at all people say oh they're a noisy tire i <laughs> you know like the jeep makes more noise than these tires do i mean i don't go super super fast but you know probably about 100 you can hear them but they're really not as bad as people say they are uh size wise these don't run true to size they're supposed to be a 33 10 5 and i think they measure up to like almost a 32 like 31 and a half a little bigger almost a 32 we'll say and on width wise i don't know like i measured them before and they're like they're almost a 10 and a half i think they're like 10.3 or something like that on the width the width is pretty well pretty well there but they're not as they're not as tall as a 33 like i know some of their tires like nikki thompson or toyo or nitto they do run true to size if you get a 35 you get a 35 but bf goodrich does seem to be like that with all their tires that uh unfortunately that's not the case but i wouldn't let that take away from them too much because they are a great tire they're not crazy crazy expensive they're not a cheap tire but you get what you pay for you get a quite decent good all-around tire as long as you look after them and rotate them and don't do burnouts and stuff in them they should last quite a long time not as long as like a ko2 all-terrain but they still they're holding up pretty well and uh, i'll update this probably a year or two from now when they get another 20 or 10,000 kilometers on them or so but yeah i think that's pretty well it if you guys enjoyed this video and want to support me hit that subscribe and like button peace out guys